Saudi Arabia's first domestic long-distance UAV fires only Chinese-made missiles and bombs. Sikr 1, Saudi Arabia's first indigenous medium-altitude, long-endurance, male, unmanned aerial vehicle, UAV, shows strong Chinese influence in its design and is armed only with Chinese-guided missiles and smart bombs. The UAV will see action against Iranian-backed Houthi rebels in Yemen fighting against a Saudi-led coalition of Sunni Arab nations. Sikr 1 was first revealed to the public a few days ago at the King Abdulaziz City for Science and Technology Kixt, in Riyadh. Kixt President Prince Turkey bin Saud bin Mohammed said Sikr 1 is equipped with a Ka satellite communication system and with thermal imaging and surveillance technology for weapons guidance. The UAV has a range of 2,500 km and can reach an average altitude of over 6,000 meters. It can fly non-stop for 24 hours powered by its Rodex 914, 95 HP, engine. Sikr 1 is 9.2 meters in length and has a wingspan of 18 meters. In appearance, Sikr 1 resembles China CH-4, CAI Hong-4, UAV operated by the Royal Saudi Air Force. Like Sikr 1, CH-4 is also a male UAV and both are armed with the same Chinese-made munitions. These weapons are the AR-1 semi-active laser-guided missile and the FT-9 guided bomb. AR-1 is used against tanks and armored vehicles, and also effective in penetrating buildings. It can pierce 1000 mm of armor plate. AR-1 has an effective range of 8 km and a circular error probable SEP, of only 1.5 meters. On the other hand, the FT-9 guided bomb weighs 50 kg, and is guided to its target by a combination GPS-in system. Sikr 1 has two hard points for a load of 250 kg. It can launch its weapons from up to 10 km away from its target. CH-4 is the CAI Hong, Rainbow, class and looks remarkably similar to the US MQ-9 Reaper UAV built by General Atomics. Some American experts believe the striking resemblance is another example of Chinese spying put to use in the real world. The reason for the CH-4S popularity in the Middle East and Africa is its price, a CH-4 costs only $1 million compared to the price tag of $30 million for the MQ-9 Reaper.